All right, guys, have me attention. Feet together, toes together, hands by your side. Bow, can they? Let's do tenants, begin. Well, where are you going, boys? Stand attention. Let's do tenants, begin. Honor, courtesy, integrity, perseverance, self-control, courage, community, and bow, come in. Jimmy. All right, guys, so warm up today. Here's what we're gonna do. You know I love timers. Two minutes. So for the first minute, I'm gonna give you guys two choices. We can either do squats or jumping jacks. Either one for the first minute. Now for the second minute, we can either do push-ups or sit-ups or crunches for the second minute. So one minute of kind of a lower body or cardio thing, and then the next minute is going to be an upper body or core thing. All right? Can you do all of them? Do you want to do all, can you do all of them in two minutes? Are you sure? Well, let's see if you can try, I don't know. Well, if it's a challenge, I'm up for it. Okay. All right, ready? So first one, jumping jacks or squats, ready? Well, I didn't mean to turn that off. Go. Jumping jacks or squats. Looks like you're doing one jumping jack and one squat. Hey, that works. <laughs> All right, keep it up. Hey, Harrison, can you back up somebody so we can see more of you and not just your belt? <laughs> there you go. Uh, we got 30 seconds left of this one. All right, keep it going. Almost through, guys, almost through. We got 10 seconds left. All right, switch to your next one, next exercise. It can be either sit-ups or push-ups. Sit-ups or push-ups. Go, go, time's going, go. Don't mind me, that's... Still, here it is. Almost through. Keep it up, guys. 30 seconds left, guys. You got this. Got better eyes than I do because I can't see it through. <laughs> I have to turn around. Almost there, guys. Got about 15 seconds left. Come on, Dion, bend them elbows. Bend them elbows. <laughs> Almost there. Three, two, one. Good job. All right. So here's the first one. Jumping jacks. All right, guys. So from here, let's go ahead and let's get into our stretches. Back arms forward. Backwards. Hugs. Up and down. All right, so hands on your hips, head up and down. Back up a little, Harrison. 
There you go. Now look left and right. Now touch your ears to your shoulders. And head circles. Out of direction. And hip side to side. Move those hips, come on. Circles. Other way circles. All right, feet together, toes together. We're gonna rotate our knees. Cover stretch. Scoop back, Harrison, onto their carpet. All right, cat back up on the hands and knees. Sit back, reach forward. Sit up, we're gonna torso twist. So right leg over top of left. Hand comes across and twist. Hands the other way, Dion. Put your hands on the other side, Dion. All right, switch feet. Other hand comes across. All right, feet apart. Hands on the head and side to side. I don't fall over.
All right, butterfly. Stand up. All right, so from here, guys, what we're going to do is we are going to work on putting together a combination of different kinds of kicks and spins, specifically crescent kicks today. Okay? So this is what the whole combination is going to look like. In, out, in, spin. That's the whole thing. But we're going to break that apart together. Okay, so first, this is what we need to do. Harrison, I need you to back up first because I can't see you. If you're that close to the screen, it's not gonna, Harrison, that's not what I meant. Come closer. That's too far away. Two steps back, Harrison. Freeze. Freeze. Where you are now, do not move unless he asks you to come towards the screen, understand? Thumbs up. Okay. All right. So from here, this is what I need. Uh, Ms. Hinkle, can I borrow you out here for a moment? Help me out. Ooh. All right, guys, so this is what it's gonna look like. If you have someone to hold a target for you, that's perfectly fine. If not, you can do these techniques in the air. That's cool. You're going to have a target. Hold it right there about nose level. If you don't have a target, you can do these techniques in the air. So I'm going to start with my feet shoulder width apart. I'm going to take one leg, and we're going to work on inside crescent kicks first. So I'm going to pick it up to the side. Go in until my feet cross. And I step it back. Let's do that five times on my count. Ready? One. Cross it over, step it back. Two, step it over, step it back without the one. Three, and go. Four, last one on this leg, five. All right, now, switching to the other foot. Just inside. So now you're going to hit the other side of the target. One. The other good leg. Two. Don't fall over. Three. Arms up, Dion. Four. Whoa, that was bad. There you go. <laughs> Last one, five. All right, so from here, now our next step is we're gonna take one leg and we're gonna hit both sides of the target. So this is what it looks like. One, two. So an inside crescent and an outside crescent, okay? So hitting both sides with a straight leg. Five times, we'll do the first one with you and then we're gonna come take a look. One, in, out, same leg, hit both sides. Two. Three. Four. Last one, five. All right, switch feet, guys. Let's take a look. Well, wait until I count. One. 
Now, Harrison, keep your eyes on it the whole time while you're kicking. That way your body doesn't turn. Two. Three. That's much better, Harrison. Nice straight leg, straight leg. And Dion, all I can see is your feet. Is there a way you can raise that camera kit up a little? Yeah, that's perfect right there. Four. Nice, hands up. Last one on this side, five. Not bad, not bad. Now, something I want you guys to think about, okay? When we're doing a crescent kick, you wanna imagine that your leg has a piece of wood attached to it and it will not let it bend. So this is the motion. It's a straight leg and it just swings. Swings from your hips, okay? So as you guys are doing this, don't bend your knees. Let's move on. And I had the mouse on and everything. <laughs> All right, guys, so from here, now we're gonna add the other foot. So we're gonna go in out with one leg, in, out, and then go in with the other leg, in. So now that my body is starting to turn. That's what I want to see. So in, out, other foot comes in, and your body's gonna turn. Okay, did you guys get to see that? Do you need to see me do it again? Harrison says no. Dion, did you see it? Dion, did you see me do it? Do you need me to do it again? Give me a thumb. I'm going to assume you saw it. Okay. All right, five times. We'll do the first one with you. One. Two. He's a love and not so much love this combination when I was younger. <laughs> Three. Four. Last one. Five. All right, so from here, now I want you to switch legs that start the combination. So if you started using your right leg first, now start with your left leg first. Okay. All right, on my count. Get ready, boys. Dion, you have to face your target. Where's your target at? One. He's doing in the air. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, that's mm -hmm. fine. Dion, I did, I counted one. Go ahead and do it. I haven't seen you do it yet. In, out, in. Good. Two. Harrison, bring up your other foot for the other kick. Come in with your other foot. Doing three total kicks. So watch one more time, Harrison. In, out. Now my other foot, in. Okay, All right. do it. In, out, and then the other, well, the other side though, buddy. So you're right with the first leg. In, out. It, yes. There you go. Yes. What numbers are they on? Three. Just say it's three. In, out, in. Keep your hands up, Dion. And I tell the little leaders, don't let the bugs in your house. This is your window. Hold up the window so the bugs don't get in. <laughs> bugs are punches and kicks. Don't get punched and kicked in your, in your house, which is your face. 
All right, forward. In, out, in. In, out, straight legs. Oh, nice in. Nice inside crescent kick, Harrison. That was pretty good. All right, last one on this side, then we're gonna spin. Five. And out, in. Cool. Cool. All right, now from here, this is when it gets a little bit interesting. I'll use that word. <laughs> So now we're going to add the spinning crescent kick, okay? So to do the spinning crescent kick, what we're gonna do, I want you to go ahead and do a setup step. So we're going to take one leg step across. Now, my body is already going this way. So I'm gonna keep it going that same direction until I can see the target again. And then I pick up the other leg, the one I did not step with, and crescent kick with that one. So this is what it looks like. I step across, turn, and kick. So let's just work on that one a little bit. So just so you guys can see what my feet are doing, I'm gonna tilt this down a bit. Because the feet part is probably more important. Actually, that's all it is, so <laughs> it's very important. So my feet are side by side. I do a setup step, I turn, and then this foot is gonna pick up to throw my kick. That was a little far away, I had to reach. All right, try it out a few times on your own, and then we'll add everything back together. Well, Harrison, hold on, buddy. Try it again, I think I saw something. Step across, turn. All right, freeze. Do it one more time, I'll tell you when to stop turning. Freeze. Now, take your left leg and kick the target. Other side. Hit the side on, yes, that's it. That's it. Now you want to kick the same direction that you're turning. If you turn this way, but kick that way, it doesn't work. Too many turns, Dion. Only one turn. Mm -hmm. Well, other side, Harrison. Remember, kick the, top, kick the side where dad's fingers are. Turn and face up, do a turn. Step, there you go, freeze. Now kick with your front leg. That's, there you go, good job, Dion. Harrison, kick the other side of the target. Kick the side closest to me. You're doing this turn and everything correctly. You just got, yeah, gotta kick that side of the target. <laughs> All right. So I think we have an okay handle on that one. Yeah. Okay. Let's see time. All right. Let's switch gears and let's add the everything back in. So the whole combination. Okay. Watch close. So if you need to, come closer to the screen so you can see how this is done and then I'll let you try. So from here, my feet are shoulder width apart. Hands are up, in, out, other foot in, turn, spin, in, out, in, spin. It rhymes. In, out, in, spin. Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> Does everyone see that? Everyone understand? Oh, Harrison turned this camera off. Can't see him anymore. No, there you are. Does anybody need to see it again? No? Dion, do you need to see it again? Yes or no? Yes. Yes? Okay. <laughs> so, 
when you swing in so my feet cross swing the same leg out feet apart other leg now is going to swing in cross the feet and I turn then swing out so I'm going to show you facing this way in Harrison, focus, buddy. In, out. Harrison, I can't, or not Harrison. Dion. Dion. We can't, we can't learn the kick if you're not watching, but look close. In, out, in, spin. Let's give it a try. Do the best you can, guys. Give it a try. Do it a few times, starting with each leg. Dion, you can't do the kick if you can't see. <laughs> Let me see here. See if he's forgetting the third kick. I'm going straight back down to get this one. Who, Harrison? Mm -hmm. Harrison, there's, there's in, out, and spin. There's four kicks, buddy. So in, out, other foot comes in, and then we do the spin. I know. I know what to do. Then if you know what to do, didn't do it, man. Dion, what are you kicking at? Are they chihuahuas? You gotta kick up higher, man. I guess he has a problem with the last one. Is it in or out? That one is out. The last out, one is okay. out. In, out, he in, goes, spin, and out. Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did it. Sort of. Good job, Harrison. And now do your spin. That's... Yeah, that's it, hey, Dion. You got it. Right. Nice job. You got it. This is not exactly the most easy drill, guys. I was holding my breath. Well, that's not a good thing. We need to breathe. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys so from here we'll put a pin in that one for now let's work on that another day so i want you to thank mom and dad or whoever's helping you out and tell them thank you now we're going to switch gears a little bit okay Today's Thursday. Two, three, six, seven, five. Woo! <laughs> All right, guys, so from here, let's switch it up a little bit. Harrison, leave the lights alone. I need you to come and do class. All right, from here, let's talk about. How do we make our stances better? Okay. So when we do a stance, there are three things we need to check for. Are my toes pointed the right direction? Are my knees bent properly? And are my feet the correct distance apart? Those three things will make every stance perfect if you check them and do what's required. Okay. So first, let's talk about sitting stance. How do we find twice as wide as our shoulders? Everyone do this with me. Stand up. Put your feet together, toes together. 
Now I'm going to pull up my pants a little so you can see my feet better. I want you to keep your heels together and pull your toes out. Now, from that position, I want you to keep your toes where they are and put your heels out. That is shoulder width apart. So when we go to June B stance, this is how far apart your feet should be, usually. Now, do that same thing again. So I'm gonna take my toes out, then my heels out. That is twice as wide as your shoulders. So this is where sitting stance is going to be. So from this position, I should have both my toes pointed forward. My knees are gonna bend out. Back straight, hands up. Now when you do this, guys, it's gonna feel like you're standing on the side of your feet. Now you wanna try to keep your feet as flat as you can. All right, show me that, boys. Dion, sitting stance, let me see it. All right, looks good, looks good. All right, go back to attention. All right, so let's talk about front stances. That one's a little bit different. So feet and toes together. Toes out, heels out. Go shoulder width apart. Now take one leg and you're gonna step it out about three times. One, two, three. Now your feet should still be about shoulder width apart. Both toes should still kind of be pointing forward. Now, here's our next thing. Look down at your front foot. If you can Harrison, see hop back toes, a couple. it's not bent enough. So bend it until you can't see your toes anymore. I can't see my toes. This is our front stance. I'm gonna show you this way so you can see how it looks from this angle. Toes out, heels out, shoulder away. One, two, three. Bend the heel, bend the heel, bend the knee until you can't see your toes anymore. Here's our front stance. Back leg straight, front one bent. All right, one more. This one, a little different. The back stance. So again, here's how I want us to do this one. Take one foot, turn it sideways. Keep your heels together though. Now, take the other one, step out once, twice, and a half times. So two and a half times, so not as long. Then bend both knees, and we're gonna shift our hips back towards our back foot. This is our back stance. Feet are in the shape of the letter L. I'm gonna show you this way. One foot goes out, step once, Twice, half. Bend, hips back. Back stance. All right, now let's go back over all of those. And I want you to kind of test them out and feel them to see if you guys are getting those stances correct. And then I have a challenge for you guys. All right, ready? Stand up here. Stand up, Harrison. Thank you. I'm gonna call out a stance. I want you to do it as fast as you can. Ready? Sitting. Check your feet. Toes forward, knees bent, back straight. All right. Attention. Back 
states. Feet are in the shape of the L, knees bent, hips back. Front stance. Both toes forward, knee bent, back straight, or back leg straight. <laughs> back to attention. All right, boys. So from here, here's our challenge. Will it reach from over here? Yes, it will. First challenge is I am going to challenge you guys to stay in a sitting stance without moving for two minutes. And there's two of us. There's both myself and Miss Hinkle. So one of us is going to be watching Dion. One of us is going to be watching Harrison. We will be able to tell if you guys are not holding your sitting stances correctly. We have to do this for two minutes without moving. All right, so your toes have to be forward. Your knees have to stay bent. A lot of times you want to come back up. Stay bent. You guys ready for the challenge? All right. Stand up. Get ready. Get watch. Get set. Go. Hold it. So uh, I've got Harrison, Miss uh, Hinkle. Okay. <laughs> now hold it tight. Bend those knees a little bit more, Harrison. A little bit more. Right there. Hold it. Make sure to breathe. I can tell you're holding breath. Breathe. <laughs> Look at that. We're already 30 seconds in. If your legs start shaking and you feel your legs get tight, that's a good thing. It means our legs are getting stronger. Stronger legs, stronger stances, stronger stances. Stronger awesome, stances. guys. A minute 15 left. Stronger kicks, breaking boards. Always fun, right? Bend those knees, Harrison. Yeah. Feel it. All right, that's half minute one minute. Good up, guys. Doing good. Don't come up. Bend, bend, bend. 40 seconds. Harrison, bend them knees. Don't you're starting to come up. Bend them. Yeah. 30 seconds. You're almost there, guys. Keep it up. Come on, come on. We're almost done. I'll say you're almost to 15 seconds, guys. You got this. Just a little bit longer. 10, 9, 8, Those knees bent. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good job. Woo! All right. Fun time, fun time. You know, and that's not the only challenge we have today. That was just one I wanted to do. <laughs> How many challenges are there? 722. Yes! I'm kidding, there's only two. <laughs> All right. So from here, guys. Now, you know we've been doing our plank challenge. So our plank challenge today, because today is Thursday, we are up to two minutes and 36 seconds. So now that our legs are nice and tired, let's make our abs tired. <laughs> All right. Bring it on. Bring it on. All right. So without further ado, let's get started. Let's get ready. Ms. Hinkle, do you have a timer? Yes, sir. Okay. I was wondering if I had to get mine. All right, two minutes, 36 seconds. When you guys are ready, she'll start it. All right, here we go, starting. Hey, Harrison, back up some, bud. Go all the way over to that carpet. Now, can you turn sideways? 
Be honest, it. get up. Harrison, turn sideways. Like turn your head towards the door. There you go. Yeah. Hold that that way. No, or, or that works too. <laughs> Flatten out, Harrison. Flatten out. Try to get your flatten, belly flatten. as close to the floor without touching, Harrison. There you go. Freeze right there. Good. Oh. <laughs> Carpet slid from underneath his feet. <laughs> Keep going. Try again. Harrison, why don't you put your feet off the carpet, your hands towards the blue bag. Well, you all said I had to be on the carpet. Well, I meant your whole body next on to the it, carpet. or next to it, the carpet. <laughs> yeah, if your whole body's on the carpet, it won't move. <laughs> okay, we're at one minute and fifteen seconds left, guys. Keep it up. Almost through, guys. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Oh, no. Harrison, get back, back up, up, man. Come on. Pop back up. Only 45 seconds left. You got this. Come on. Almost there, guys. 30 seconds left. Come on, Harrison. You got it, buddy. In the home stretch. In the home stretch. Come on, Harrison. Oh, man. Get back up. We're almost done. Almost done. Almost there, man. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. Good job, guys. Time. All right. Wonderful. Wonderful. Bye, All right. So I want to thank you guys for coming out today, having some fun. Keep working hard. And I will see you all next time. So keep in mind, guys, that we're going to come back into class having in-person classes on, was it Tuesday of next week? Mm -hmm. Yeah, 27th, is that right? 26th, 27th? 26th. 26th. And uh, what time? What time for what, ma'am? For the class uh, at Academy. I do not have a. I, it's at um, for beginners. It's at six o'clock. Yes. I'm a beginner. Okay, and so when the class starts at academy, there won't be any online classes, right? There will be online classes offered in the mornings, and then in the afternoons, in the evenings is when we'll have the in-person classes. But we have limited okay. spots available on the floors, so not everybody will be able to take advantage of those. So that's why we're doing both the online and in person. Okay, so uh, one last question. Yes. To get in the academy, do we have to like call? How do we do? Not to my knowledge. You know? It's kind of first come, first like, serve. Oh, okay.